I got it in my eye. Not the first time. Hello everyone, me East and West. Can't see me. The chaotic energy is crazy. I didn't even wear a jacket. I don't know who the hell I think I am. Hi. Right now I have sweat in areas. I should not have sweat. <laughs> Hi everyone! <coughs> I'm not gonna lie to y'all, my eating HD is acting up right now. The pre-workout that I took earlier, it's still kicking and it's almost 10 o'clock. I've just been like on one today and I'm so happy that I am because I've been needing this kind of workout for a little bit. I already left the gym. I ran for like a total of like, a, like 50 minutes today. Obviously not all at once, I separated it in halves, but still. And then someone sent me a text message that really pissed me off. So when I actually left the gym, I had more energy. That was actually just more anger. So I decided I'm just gonna go for a run at night in the winter. My um, throat and lungs are a little sore at the moment, but I had a blast. If you've never run in the cold, I suggest it. My body's a little confused right now because my temperature is just going boo, but I'm very happy that I did that. <laughs> Tonight we're gonna just do a really quick get unready with me. I'm gonna go to bed because I'm sweaty as hell right now. I have sweat in areas. I should not have sweat. Look how cute! A little camel pack. Obviously I only really use it like in the summertime when I need, you know, to run. <laughs> but I figured why not? Let's just in case my throat gets a little sore or dry. It's the cold air, you know? You know what's really crazy? That people I don't feel like talk about enough in the gym community. Oh, also, I'm ha uh, uh -huh. Well. <laughs> Jesus, that's not blood in my throat or anything. I just dropped some protein shake on my rug. Love that. Anyways, I'm having a quick protein shake after my run because I already actually had dinner prior to going on the run. Well, the second run. So I'm just trying to hit that protein intake, obviously, for the day. Don't come at me for using protein shakes. I'm a busy woman, okay? But yeah, back to what I was saying. Nobody really talks about the fact that being a gym rat, bro, the amount of laundry I have to do, disgusting. Absolutely ridiculous. No! You wanna see me chug it? I'll do it. Go, go, go! Period! Let's go take our makeup off. Bye! Woo! You can see me now. You can't see me. We're in my bathroom, so I'm just gonna go ahead and take off some of my makeup with a little wipe and some micellar water. And then I'm actually gonna hop in the shower and actually wash my face and get this all off for good get deep in there. It may kind of look like I'm like rubbing really, really hard on my skin. I promise I'm not. My skin gets really pink or red easily. So if that happens, just fair warning. Oh, oh I got it in my eye. Not the first time. <laughs> <coughs> Jesus, my ADHD is on one today. I'm going to make a video coming up, guys. This was just one scoop of pre-workout that I took today. When I go to the gym and I'm going to take two scoops and we're going to see how I behave in the gym. Let's hope that I'm a normal human being. Who am I kidding? <laughs> That's not gonna happen. And then I go in with a clean one just to like clean up any excess or whatever. Either way, I'm gonna go shove my face with some CeraVe face wash so it doesn't have to be perfect. I'm about to go hop in the shower. Care to join me? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'll see y'all in a little bit. Don't forget to drink your water, y'all. I am obsessed with this little bottle. I got it off of Amazon mad long ago, but I literally use it for everything <laughs> possible. I had my gym friend the other day tell me, look at you being a fucking troll. Of course, you're the only person in here that would have like a square water bottle. And I'm like, what the fuck does that even mean? He hates me. I know he hates me. It's okay. Buy cute PJs for yourself, okay? Sometimes it makes you feel good, even if somebody's not coming over, you know what I'm saying? So my makeup is already washed off, and I took my earrings out, brushed my teeth. I actually just put on my toner without recording, my bad. We're going to put on some serum. Can I just mention also how the other day I got let off so easy with the cops. I am so thankful for that man. <coughs> so the other day I was actually leaving a restaurant after going to the gym. I met up with some family. Then I got stopped by the cops. One thing about me, I hate to say it, but I'm pretty irresponsible when it comes to stuff with my car. Like my house and my other bills and everything else, like I'm good. When it comes to my car, if I never had to do an oil change, I would never do an oil change. If I never had to like put in gas, I probably never would. I'm really bad. <laughs> and if like my car payment and my insurance didn't come out automatically, I probably would never be paying it. Long story short, my registration was expired. I didn't know. This is so embarrassing. Mind you, my sticker was also expired. You know how embarrassing it is when you pull over and the guy that pulls you over is one of the guys from your gym? 
I have never spoken to this guy, but we do see each other all the time. Literally as I'm like renewing like the registration online and everything, he was just standing there like, oh, you got it? Or, <laughs> and I was just like, it's going through just, just a minute. You go to my gym, right? He was like, yes, I do. And I was just like, that, that's embarrassing. Um, so he was like really nice. He's like, you know, I can find you. I can do all this stuff. Listen, just fix your registration right now. Get your sticker changed, please. I was so scared because another cop pulled up and I was like, oh my God, I'm going to get arrested tonight. I don't even know what's happening right now. I'm very fucking scared. But I don't know if he's just secretly a nice person that I've just never talked to or what. Because he was definitely nice enough and he let me off with like a slap on the wrist and like a verbal warning. And guess what? The next day I got everything taken care of. I fixed my sticker. My registration is all set. So I'm going to go for now. <laughs> Between me and y'all, I was petrified. I washed my face. I did a toner, serum, moisturizer. I exfoliated my lips a little bit and I just put on some chapstick. So now I'm just going to brush my hair. And honestly, this seems like a nightmare for some people because I definitely should not be doing this. I just had to rinse out some of the hairspray that I had, honestly, because I'm not going to go to bed with hairspray in my hair. But guess what I am going to do? Sorry. I'm going to go to bed with wet hair. I know. I know. I'm a terrible person. I should rot in the pits of hell. I get it. It's okay. I don't know that police officer's name, but... Thank you very much. And honestly, I hope to never see you at the gym again because now I'm embarrassed. Cause I know for a fact I got a parking ticket or something in there somewhere that I still haven't taken care of. I find a ticket, I just throw it in the back of my car. Also, I'm so excited for the future content I'm gonna be making for y'all. I have a video that's coming out that I'm very, very excited to put out. It's for all my New Year's resolutioners that are just starting out in the gym. And I can't wait to show you. Don't be alarmed. I don't always go to bed with wet hair. This is a once in a blue moon type of thing. It's just nights like tonight when I'm up for a little bit longer. I don't really have the time to be waiting for my hair to air dry before I go to bed. Tonight, it's just gonna have to be what it is. Put it in like a little protective style. I usually put it in a bonnet for me. Wash your hands before you do any of this. In case y'all didn't know, I am actually blind as a bat. So here's my contact. <laughs> and when you have had contacts for so long, you're like so good at just taking them out like without even looking. Y'all ready for this? All right, so we were in my room, and yeah, the lighting is like a lot worse. I like it dim, okay? I like to go to bed smelling good, so I will also spray myself sometimes because I like to wake up just smelling good too. You know what I'm saying? That's some really stuff right there. I'm not gonna lie to you about it. That's no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> also, let me just say really quick, if you have an issue with a saggy chest, don't watch my videos. Bye. I don't care. Hello everyone, meet East and West. You know what that's called? That is called all natural. At least that part of me is. This is the last thing I have to do and it is put my retainers in because I'd be hearing that a lot of y'all that got braces decided that they didn't want to actually put their retainers in after they paid all that money. I mean, maybe some of y'all the insurance did it, but still. Thank you all for getting on ready with me. I'm gonna go to bed because I go to bed about eight o'clock every day. It is currently 10 18. So this grandma, you know what I'm saying? Thank you all for spending time with me and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.